In California, they had a very unique uh, model of service for families, which was, it was called BIS, or it stands for Behavioral Intervention Service, which meant that, that people who have a behavioral orientation for uh, intervention would be uh, given referrals and we would basically go into the home and not just kind of watch the kid and their family and their homes and determine what the problem is and why it's occurring, but then it's like on-the-job coaching for the parent we would actually show them how to do that with their kid. And then, while we're still there, say, okay, the next time he does that, it's your turn. Right. Yeah, so it is truly coaching. Yeah. It's on-the-job coaching. And with that, you know, not only did the child's be well, the child's behavior changed because the parent learned how to manage them more efficiently. Because the parent's behavior changed. Because the parent's behavior changed, right. I think a lot of people have misconceptions about what punishment is. So the issue is, you want something that will teach the child not to do that again, right? Okay, so get something that's pretty reasonable, but use it every single time. We taught them, you know, how to be consistent. Um, I actually have a book that's online, free, for parents. And one of the first cases I described, this one uh, lady who had a child who was four years old with developmental disabilities, he was like a hurricane going through the house. I mean, he was, you know, every 30 seconds he was either pulling something out, hitting his sister, doing whatever. And, you know, we said, okay, let's focus on just whenever he hits his sister, we're going to put him in timeout. It took me quite a while just to teach her that every time meant every time.